So hello all, uh, we have with us Rahul Kumar who has recently made a successful tran transition from support to data science. Uh, he has actually got recruited in a company named as Startup Gymnome, you know, and again, I think it is a startup. Uh, we'll, we'll know more about that specific company from Rahul itself. But uh, Rahul, first of all, congratulations for this amazing transition. Um, before we go ahead, Rahul, just give a brief history about you, like what was your previous work and uh, you know, what you used to do, how many years experience you are, just some basic info. And then further, I'll be asking different questions in chat. Uh, sure. Thank you, Krishna. So uh, if I talk about my past experience, so after passing out from uh, my college in 2019, I still, I was from BTEC background from computer science and engineering, but I started my initial work with a support specialist in uh, my previous company, open company. And after that, uh, I was, I was just looking for a good career field, which, you know, gives me a vision for the, my upcoming 10 years, because I did there, it was like, you know, it was not that much good. So what I thought is at least look for something. So I started exploring AI, where the first step is obviously the machine learning part. And it also has a first step, which is data analyst. So I started exploring a couple of courses, like investing some money, then learning from here and there, and, you know, just roaming around. And then I found, first of all, your channel, where I got to know pretty good knowledge in a, in a very structured format, like your playlist, uh, you know, uh, the blogs as well in terms of motivation. It really kept me going through the last year, like in 2019 and 20, where I was also working, but still I was not growing in terms of knowledge. Because uh, from a tech background, I was always thinking that why I should, uh, you know, work for the, it, it was not worth it to give 10 years in such background, because it's not a good or bad work. It's just what I want to do. So I started exploring things and uh, yeah, I got eye neuron once I, uh, you know, was exploring your channel. And I, in fact, it was, it was uh, some days I used to complete ML playlist and deep learning playlist in a week, in a week, I, you know, back, back to back, I watched your videos. It was like a pretty good story, which gives me a very clearer picture what exactly ML is rather than any other thing or any other uh, channels, which people usually prefer on YouTube. So that was a, you know, a good story for me to follow a good path for me to follow. And, uh, yeah, I joined I neuron course and studied for four months and followed the assignments by heart, how to do that. Even I wrote the comments into the, my assignment note, how am I doing that? So that's what I did. And uh, luckily when I was, you know, gave, given a task in my interview, it, pretty much, you know, matched with that. So I was pretty happy that a course can help me a lot. Okay. So guys, just to go ahead, like Rahul joined the course in January, you know, of 2021, uh, the MLDL course from iNeuron. And within, I think, what, four months, I think you're able to make a transition. You know, it's pretty much amazing. I think you, you did that self-paced course also continuously in terms of learning, right, I guess? Yeah, I mean, I did that, but, you know, obviously, uh, the thing is, you have to be a self learner always. No, self paced basically can... uh, you watch the recorded videos also, I guess. Because exactly, that... yeah. exactly. Because from uh, Feb, uh, January 4th till when this batch was started, I watched all the recordings. Like uh, Python was completed at that point of time, but still I watched it. I completed the assignments just because I wanted to, you know, don't want it to be left apart or, you know, back. Okay. Now but, let's uh, talk about the experience. Oh, first of all, let's talk about the company that you're saying, right? Startup Genome, like what exactly, in what work it actually does, you know, in short, just in so, one minute, I think uh, you can just talk in one minute. Yeah. So uh, actually Startup Genome is a public policy company, which creates some reports and their major product is global uh, startup ecosystem report, which is published every June uh, of the, every year. So they publish rankings of each and every ecosystem. An ecosystem is just like, for example, Delhi, it has many yeah. cities around by. So how startups are working and what sort of ecosystem they require. Yeah. So this is how it, these com this company works. It is a non-profit organization, but they have, they are data driven. They always make their decisions on data driven sources and they use some pretty good tools, you know, yeah. uh, in terms of analysis. So okay, now let's what, talk about the experience with respect to the interview. Like, how was the interview? What are questions they asked? Just whichever you remember, you know, and uh, were there any questions that you could not answer? 
anything as such you know or just tell us the pattern like how how did the actual interview go ahead so uh, first of all i you know gone through i go through the job description pretty thoroughly what they wanted mm-hmm. and my resume pretty matched uh, pretty i mean matched pretty good at, on that way so i was selected or shortlisted and then uh, the lead of the company the lead data scientist here uh you know he was the first interaction or you can say that it was my first round when he asked me very basic questions how what background i work on and how, why did i apply for it as a data analyst he just wanted to know about me uh, first and then he asked me what sort of packages did i did i use uh, for the analysis in my uh, day to day work so this was just a very basic question uh in terms of technical he just asked me about uh, he yeah two of the major databases which i would always yeah. suggest to, if the audience are watching is sql as well as no sql which is precisely mongo db yeah. because mongo db is like 99% of the companies i think yeah. are demanding now yeah. and here also the demand was yeah. so and thank god that at that point of time sudanshu sir completed mongo db Mm. yeah the sessions it really helped me out into the interview question because he was, he was just giving me the terminal and he was asking me okay write this command and get me some data out of it so mm. i did that uh it was a, a short first round and for the second round so the first round was more about little bit of practical you know probably uh, yeah. work with the databases like sql or no sql mongo db like kind of stuff exactly yeah mm. and uh, the first round when completed then i joined for the second round where they asked me to write some python codes on dedupping uh, dedupping the columns which means uh, you know just removing the duplicate ones and mm-hmm. just basic stuff they just wanted to know my approach uh, mm-hmm. how i how i uh, you know how am i doing it what sort of things i use mm-hmm. so they pretty liked it they i mean the lead gave me a good feedback mm-hmm. and said that uh, we want you here so once the second round completed then the third was just you know Uh, background check you know from so mostly of- related to data analyst work only like data pre processing yeah. kind of stuff how to handle exactly. missing values probably yeah. duplicate values all those kind of stuff right yeah. so uh, mostly they were focusing on python and databases i can consider in this way exactly right? yeah. for the data analyst role. anything they probably asked with respect to power bi or tableau any business intelligence tool as such uh in the business intelligence part they asked me have you prepared any uh, do you know about tableau precisely because they have an integrated mm. tableau tool which i you know mm. once i was recruited so for the tableau part they just asked me if you know how uh, thoroughly i can read the graphs mm. you know how thoroughly i can make it and how thoroughly i can mm. read it so uh, thank god the uh, the content for that also is available in <laughs> i neuron's dashboard <laughs> i watched a couple of a, a, a couple of videos 4 hours to 5 hours Mm. and it helped me also you know in that way mm. so they they just knew that okay this guy knows the things that's mm. it mm. Yeah. okay so this is how it helped amazing amazing so uh, it's more about uh, uh, presentation of that or uh, bringing out some meanings of that specific graph right uh, exactly you know kind of first thing. they check me yeah first they check me how you know he is getting the data secondly they check me how he can make it a good uh, preparation of that and thirdly the third round it was like more of a pipeline which they were you know following and then how, what what good graphs he can make so purely data analyst uh, role is they were checking on me yeah okay amazing amazing this is uh, pretty much amazing okay now let's come back uh, you know regarding your experience in i neuron probably about the team sudanshu teaching my teaching probably the skype support uh, if you have two minutes if you can talk about that too you know? uh, definitely if i talk about uh, core structure i been mean, every data science student or data analyst student struggles with is the structure of the content which they are learning so what i uh, you know give a strong and a very uh, a feedback from my heart to all my audience or to all our audiences you know just believe in what you are studying at i do you know just just give yourself 100% that's all odd i can say because the support is work i mean at 12 am as well i just you know i was just uh, you know struggling with some some dashboard issue even the technical part as well and they just helped me at 12 am as well so i don't think uh, you know i mean the sudanshu sir is following a code which is affordable ai education and he's living it so i will definitely say uh, in terms of your teaching as well if i should say the youtube channel it's just not the youtube channel uh, 
I'm not comparing you and Sudanshu sir, but Sudanshu sir has a very good way of explaining maths behind each and every algorithm, which I'm experiencing now when he has started them. And you know, YouTube channel, I mean, Krishna is awesome. So no, no such complaints in that as well. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, and um, any 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 such uh, did they ask any kind of use cases also for you? Something like that. Uh, uh, you, actually, questions in short. In short, uh, actually no, because in my resume I clearly mentioned what how much I have worked, you know, okay. what sort of inter- internship and what work I did. So they knew that how much he knows, you know. And uh, accordingly to that, he they gave me the task. And precisely, it was just the coding parts which they were more focusing on. They just wanted to see the codes, how I how it was writing. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So amazing, uh, uh, Rahul. Uh, this is pretty much amazing that you have made a successful career transition. We from I Neuron are pretty much happy by your success. I hope you grow. Now it's time to fly. You know, uh, where you have finally got the thing that you have liked, and probably you'll be getting some amazing use cases going ahead where you'll be able to learn. And always we are there to support you in the back end. Uh, since the course is still out going on, any questions that you have, you can also definitely ask. So thank you for the feedback and definitely I'll convey all this feedback to both Sidanshu, entire iNeuron team, you know, and probably they'll also be watching this specific video, right? Sure. So thank you all guys. Uh, and thank you uh, Rahul once again for coming and spending some of your time to tell people about this. Uh, any final thing that you really want to give any kind of motivation to the people? before we end this conclusion, because there are many people who say that no, from this profile to this profile, they cannot jump, you know, they cannot make this kind of switch. I think you have heard of this kind of things also probably. Anything yeah. That you want to say? Uh, yeah, I mean, my friends used to tell that, <laughs> you know, who are working in uh, the software industry. So I just want to tell one thing that uh, just believe in the process which you are following, especially at iNeuron. You don't have to doubt yourself for the process and don't have to you know, roam here and there. Just stick to one thing and follow it by art. Uh, that's going to give you much more results in terms of, you know, you don't have to look here and there. That's what I want to say. Yeah. Amazing. So thank you, Rahul, uh, for this time. Uh, thank you, everyone, for seeing this video. Uh, I'll give the LinkedIn profile of Rahul in the description of this particular video. If you have any questions, you can definitely ask him. So this was it from our side, guys. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a great day. Thank you, Wandal. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Rahul. Thank you.